The controversy between APC national leader Senator Bola Ahmed Tinubu and the chairman Chief John Odige Oyegun had been rumored over months. It finally came to the fore after the Ondo State APC governorship primaries. Senator Bola Ahmed Tinubu called on the national chairman to immediately resign over alleged wrongdoings, connivance and compromise. During a book launch on the president Monday, they managed to sheath their sword and put up smiling faces, apparently because the crowd was watching. A day after, the national chairman was sighted at the Asorok presidential villa, entering the office of the president alone. After hours of meeting, he came out to a large number of journalists waiting for him. The first question, would he resign following the demand of Senator Bola Ahmed Tinubu? Nobody had the, the method for getting rid, if that's the word I will call it, uh, of a national chairman as spelled out in the constitution. They don't take place on the pages of newspapers. He, however, denied reported rift with the APC national leader, but noted that Senator Bola Ahmed Tinubu was not fair to him with the statement he issued. Is there a rift with uh, uh, the Ashiwaji? There's no rift. He has, we have a difference of opinion, yes. Uh, difference of perception, yes. And in politics, I think that is normal. Yes, I agree that uh, uh, the nature of the statement was a bit harsh. But what? Are you when asked if his party would revisit the controversial APC on those state governorship primaries, he directed journalists to INEC. The APC national leader, Chief John Odige Oyegun, had entered the office of the president just behind me, spent time and apparently clear himself of any wrongdoing. The APC national leader, Senator Bola Ahmed Tinubu, undoubtedly we also took time after all of this to react. With all of this still happening, one would not be wrong to conclude that the controversy rocking the All Progressives Congress is far from over. From the Asorok Presidential Villa, I'm Ikharo Atta, ITV News, Abuja.